Hello everyone, Jeremias here and welcome back for another video. We have Champions League with two very good and very equalized games. In the first order we have Atletico de Madrid receiving Manchester United with Cristiano Ronaldo wanting to increase his personal record. He has scored 25 times in 35 matches against Atletico de Madrid. On the other hand, we have Benfica receiving Ajax. In the game, when a player managed to score for both teams, the locals managed to stop a team with a perfect group stage. This is day four of the Champions League playoff. We will start with the game of Manchester United visiting Atletico de Madrid. Atletico de Madrid was facing their worst nightmare. Not has only Cristiano Ronaldo scored to them 25 times, but he also beat them in two Champions League finals. Atletico de Madrid managed to neutralize Cristiano Ronaldo and Manchester United, but could not hold on to the lead that they found in the early minutes of the game, considering a late goal that set the match into a tie. Joao Felix, dubbed to be Cristiano Ronaldo's successor in Portugal, put Atletico de Madrid ahead with a beautiful header in the seventh minute, and everything seemed to be over after that. But at minute 80, just 5 minutes after he joined the game, Anthony Elanga set the equalizer that will be the final result of this match. Atletico de Madrid had the initiative for most of the game, and wanted to go to look for another goal after the equalizer. Antoine Griezmann hit the post at minute 86 in what could have been the win for the Colchoneros. Both teams had more chances in the end, but neither of them were able to finish. From Spain, we move next door to Portugal, where Benfica was receiving Ajax. After just a splendid group stage, making it 6 out of 6, Ajax put their demolition machine at the test in Lisboa, after a local team that was not in their best shape, and still managed to draw a tie out of the game. They ended in two goals on each side, and everything will be decided on Amsterdam on March 15. It was a great game that we had at the Estadio da Luz in the Portuguese capital, where Dusan Tadic set the visitors ahead after 70 minutes, after a beautiful cross of Nusair Mathro. However, after 25 minutes there was a corner kick in favor of Benfica, and the ball was deflected. The play continued and Jan Vertogen set the cross in, and very unluckily Sebastian Heller hit the ball and scored a known goal for the equalizer for the Portuguese team. Heller himself redeemed 4 minutes later and set Ajax again in the lead. It was after a cross that he anticipated inside the box and after a rebound give by the whole keeper Odysseus Blagodimos, he put the ball in for the 2-1 in favor of the visiting team. Heller himself missed the chance of picking up a rebound and increasing the deficit in the end of the first half after he shot wide after Edson Alvarez hit the post. In the second half, Ajax were unable to find a way to close the game, and it was on minute 72 that Benfica equalized. Roncalo Ramos shot from a half distance, and the goalkeeper Remco Pasvir gave the rebound to Roman Jaremuk, who got the equalizer for the home team, which was the final result of the match. Well, that will be everything for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to hit that like button to support the channel and subscribe to us to receive the latest content. I want to read you in the comment sections. Do you think that Cristiano Ronaldo will be again the executioner of Atletico de Madrid or the Colchoneros will take revenge on their old nemesis? As always, guys, it has been a real pleasure and I hope to see you all again in the next video. Around the ball.